Tina, thank you. During the pandemic, a lot of us spent more time at home making meals in the kitchen rather than going out. And while certainly that's fun for a while, Tess, I can only eat so many sloppy joes and hamburgers, right? And mac and cheese. And mac and cheese. And Uncrustables. That's and pretty that's much your diet. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> You, you nailed it. <laughs> we know each other too well. And you know what? I think everyone is ready for some new ideas and also maybe to help shed those extra pounds we gained over the past year. So we checked in with our partners at Cooking Light. Some say cooking is fun. Others see it as a chore. Cooking meals has become more of a to-do list item. And it's not something that I always look forward to every day, which is why I love the cooking light diet and why I've always been such a big fan of it. Award winning dietitian Carolyn Williams says the meal plan from cooking light will help not just expand your culinary choices, but it'll also help you make healthy choices. So they use real ingredients, real food, but they also incorporate simple hacks and tricks to make preparation simple, make meals come together quicker. You know, one of the things I love about the cooking light diet is that no foods are off limits. There are not good foods and bad foods. Sure, there are foods we need to eat more of and foods we need to eat less of, but nothing is off limits. I feel like the cooking light diet is one diet that's unique in that it fully embraces that. If you want a recipe for macaroni and cheese, Cooking Light Diet is going to find you one and give you one. If you want chicken enchiladas, um, anything you want, you can find it. And I, I love that Cooking Light makes it so easy to incorporate all foods that you love and all dishes. I think one of the biggest things, too, with the Cooking Light Diet is that time after work now is just such a great way to relax. I've always liked cooking. Um, it's definitely a diet for people who like cooking. Mm -hmm. And we get to spend that time in the kitchen and talking about our day. And, you know, he's a great sous chef. He helps chop, prep, um, just keep me company. It's just been really easy to integrate into our day to day. And really, I think it's made it easier. Williams helped design the Cooking Light meal plan, which is customized for each person. It's designed to be a plan. It takes into account um, some of your health statistics, like your height and your weight and your goals. It takes into account your dietary preferences and any food allergens. And then it generates a suggested meal plan. And this is really helpful for people who may have certain dietary preferences or, or intolerances, like maybe they need a dairy-free diet or a gluten-free diet. So to find out more about the meal plan, the tricks and tips for fixing some great tasting meals, you can check out Cooking Light magazine as well as the Cooking Light website. Cooking Light, by the way, is produced by the parent company of Arizona's family, the Meredith Corporation. So I know we're always talking about uh, what are you making for dinner? Do you have a new recipe? <laughs> Cooking Light has so many great ideas. Awesome. And if you uh, just check it out, it's all for free for the first 30 days. And then there's a subscription that comes out to like $1.50 a week if you really uh -huh. want to do it. But it gives you the grocery list too, Gene. Gina, oh, I know you like I that. It. Well, it's that insidious <laughs> question every night. What's for dinner? Oh, yeah. And you don't oh. want to always get takeout. You can't do that. Not healthy. And, you know, I can only have so many pizza rolls, too. So. <laughs> Thanks, Tess. <laughs>